Did you know that your money could be in danger if you were invested in a diversified portfolio of stocks and bonds? It's not the stocks that are necessarily the one that you risk losing your money on. It's the bonds. Everybody thinks bonds are always super, super safe, and they're not. I'm going to share with you in this video why they're not always safe and tell you when they are safe and what types of bonds are always safe. Hi, I'm Camille Gaines, founder of FinancialWoman.com and author of Earn, Grow, Give. I'm a financial coach, an author, a writer, and I share what I've learned from over 30 years of investing my own money. So everybody feels like bonds are safe or they it's probably not a feeling so much as is is it's been taught that bonds are always safe and you do have that stability say with US treasuries that well gosh surely it's going to be okay if I invest in US treasuries but here's what happens with bonds okay when interest rates go up bonds go down. So the value of the bonds go down and here's why. It makes so much sense but people don't they don't understand this or they overlook and it's so simple I'm going to show you. So let's say that you have a bond you bought a, a bond portfolio but but let's just look at one bond for example to simplify things and the bond funds will move in the same way for the same type of bond. So let's say that you buy a bond and the coupon on the stated interest rate on that bond is 3%. So it's going to pay you 3% while you own that bond. And then let's say that interest rates go up though and the new bonds come out and they pay 4%, okay? So what's going to happen well, what will happen to the value of this bond right here that you paid $1,000 for? What would happen to it? Well, if people can, can now get a new bond that pays 4%, the value of your bond is going to go down. And so when you, when you own bonds that are longer term in nature and they've locked in that lower interest rate and bonds go the, the interest rate goes up so that people can then get new bonds with that higher interest rate is only natural. It makes total sense that the value of your bonds are going to go down and when you get ready to sell those bonds you won't be able to get the same amount of money that you paid for the bonds. So just remember when interest rates go up the value of your bonds goes down. Now interest rate trends are very very slow. Would you believe that in the early 1980s the prime rate was almost 20 percent and it sounds just crazy now since as I record this we have been in historical low interest rates for so many years now and now they're starting to inch back up and that's why I felt it was really important for me to make this video and let you know that long-term bonds go down in value when interest rates go up. Now I promised that I would tell you what type of bonds are safe always and that is very, very short-term bonds and I, I can barely really even say always because even a very, very short-term bond will be affected. It will drop slightly in value when interest rates go up, but it won't drop like a 20-year bond would that has locked in that lower rate. So the shorter term type of money market kind of short-term bonds or other very, very short-term uh, debt instruments, I hate to use financial lingo, but I can't think of another word for that. The shorter term they are, they're safer when interest rates are going up as far as your value dropping. So that's what I wanted to share in this video. How can you apply this? Look at your portfolio and see if you hold bonds in your portfolio. See when you bought them and be aware that the value of your bonds will go down as interest rates go up. That's what I wanted to share. If you like this information, you found it helpful, please be sure to let me know, like the video, subscribe to my channel.